welcome back. It might be a little loud and you probably can't hear me. Got my coffee. <laughs> okay, I'm doing a morning routine, I guess. I don't really know. It's nine o'clock. Technically, I don't even have to get ready yet. I'm just taking my time. Anyway. I'm putting on self tan on my face because it's pale and I don't feel like being that pale. So I use a wet beauty blender, whatever you want to call it, sponge. And I don't know how old this is. It's probably a little too old, but I ran out of my favorite highlighter. So I just had to find this one. Um, I put it on my hand like this. Then I use beauty cream from Maybelline. Squirt it on. Maybelline. I actually like their stuff. And then I use this other foundation. <laughs> Just a little bit though. And I mix it together with the end of a brush. I saw someone do this a few years ago and it changed my life. If I was mixing foundations. And I don't know where I learned this, but everyone like four years ago was like, you have to mix foundation. Probably not the most sanitary way to put it on, but I don't, I don't care. And then I just put it on my face. Then I just blend this in. I hate editing videos, so this is going to be a long one to edit. For concealer, it honestly changes. Oh, I put on self tanner, so this might be a little too light. But I'm just going to be using this Urban Decay All Nighter, what is this called, concealer, because I hate my Tarte Shape Tape Concealer, but for some reason I just use it um, pretty much every single day still. I don't know, I have gotten like a lot of recommendations for the NARS concealer but I haven't tried it yet and I probably should because I literally hate shape tape. Like there's just something about it that I just hate. It's so cakey. This might be cakey too actually now that I'm looking at it. And I hate that. And I guess like that's pretty normal. Like the makeup that you see on TikTok or my alarm went off and it cut my video off. The makeup that you see on Instagram and TikTok just isn't real. It makes you look like way um, smoother, I guess. Which I knew that, but some people's skin actually is that smooth, which is crazy and shiny. <laughs> Moving on. I guess contour. I have a love hate relationship with contour as well. Sometimes I'll do cream contour, sometimes I'll do powder, sometimes I combine. Today, I guess I'll combine. I don't know like really how to do this, so don't judge. The cream version is just like hard. I've been having this outfit in my head that I'm wearing today for like a little while, so I hope it looks good. If it doesn't, I'm going to be like really sad if I put it on and I think I look bad in it. That's what the biggest letdown is when I think of an outfit and I put it on and it looks like trash. And then I have to take it off. You don't know how many times that happens to me. Most of my outfits that I actually wear out of the house are not planned. They're like, I plan an outfit and it looks ugly or I think it looks bad. So I just put on like something so basic and so simple and then I just wear that. And then I'm like, mm, I just should have gone with the other one. Who cares? I'm gonna be tired in like four seconds. I feel like I've been walking around all week this week and it's getting on my nerves. So yesterday I just didn't do anything because I had nothing to do. So I just sat in my bed for like 7 million hours, which was so fun to me. I was waiting for the train to pass. I still do nose contour because it makes my face look like all together. Um, 
I think all the things that I do on my makeup are pretty much just habit because I've been doing it for a long time just like this. So. I mean, I can change my ways. I just haven't. I don't like how my head's cut off. But I just use this like really old contour palette from Ulta. Like, I don't know how yeah, even how old this is. Probably way too old to be using. But um, I haven't ran out, so I just keep using it. And I only use like two colors, so. I use the same palette for my eyeshadow, contour, and eyebrows. Um, it's just easier that way and then that way it all matches now i'm doing my eyebrow like tint it's not a tint it's like a gel eyebrow gel but it's brown and then after this i'll do clear eyebrow gel next is blush sometimes i'll do this blush as my lipstick or whatever and it looks so cute like too much blush I know it's kind of a trend but I don't really like it on myself on some people it looks good but I tried to put on like blush a lot of blush one day and or more than I usually do and it just looked funny on me I used to be like why is this leaking okay if anyone wants like a lip plumping lip gloss go to Amazon and get this one D-E-R-O-L because it's so good it makes your it kind of stings your lips a little bit which is like the point but it is it makes them like really look like plump for like a little while obviously if you like have a drink which i shouldn't have put that on because now i still have to drink my coffee but if you're like drinking out of a drink or something obviously it's gonna like go away okay so this is the part that i don't like which is eyeliner i wish i had a smaller eyeliner brush because i i don't like this black eyeliner because it's so harsh but the brown like eyeshadow that I use is too, it's too like smudgy. And this brush is too big. Like I need one that's smaller. All right, moving on, I guess, to mascara. First I'm gonna do this. I don't even know if this works. Probably not. I forgot to do something. I forgot to put on my highlighter. I'll put on mascara then do it. Okay, I use two different mascaras. And honestly, the mascara that I use switches every day. Today I'm using this one. I need a new one. But this has been my tried and true ever since I was in ninth grade. All right, I think I'm done with it. It looks good to me. I'm calling it a day on the makeup front. Now, to do oh my leg i've just been ha having it like in the same position for like 40 minutes and now it hurts all right now to do my outfit i'll be right back okay i'm gonna cry because i just have a feeling so i have this like short sleeve bodysuit with these green pants If it doesn't look good, I might cry. I'm being so for real. All right, I'm gonna put it on. I'll show you in a second. Okay, it actually doesn't look that bad. So. These pockets are the tiniest things ever. Okay, I'll show you. I can't stand up and show you because you can't see. Ignore this, that's school that I have to do schoolwork so this is the fit i'll probably wear this 
I've been debating wearing Uggs yet. And I don't know if I should or not because it's not that cold yet. But everyone, like some people have started to wear them. Not with this outfit, that's for sure. I'll probably wear these Converse today. I'll let me try them on. Okay, wait, I'm actually really happy. And it's probably gonna be cold, so I'll just wear this sweater over it. Yes, okay, it actually looks really good. Got the fit. Anyway, that's all. And I'll probably put on different earrings because to dress it up a little, not any necklaces. Anyway, thanks for watching. See you in the next one.